Henrik Stenson has reportedly withdrawn from the final two events in the European Tours race to Dubai because of a rib injury he sustained during a promotional photo shoot at the WGC HSBC Champions last month. Stenson finished T35 last week at the Turkish Airlines Open, but he explained that he was far from 100%. The Swede hinted that his injury stemmed from the October 24 publicity stunt where several top-ranked players were suspended in the air by a harness while donning capes. I'm not Superman even though certain people thought I was Superman, Stenson said. While he described his upcoming schedule as pending on Sunday, a report from the UK's Telegraph on Monday indicated that Stenson has pulled out of this week's Ned Bank Golf Challenge and next week's DP World Tour Championship. His status for the November 30-December 3rd Hero World Challenge, which he entered as an alternate following the withdrawals last week of Jason Day and Mark Leishman, remains uncertain. According to the Telegraph report, Stenson is also annoyed about being persuaded to take part in the photo shoot. While other participants included world number no. 1 Dustin Johnson and defending champ Hideki Matsuyama, the report indicates that other notable players refused to participate in the escapade. Article tags Henrik Stenson went to improve your game want a quick lesson and by quick, we mean, 510 seconds quick. Joe Compatello, the director of instruction at Plainfield Country Club in Edison, New Jersey, teamed up with Callaway to provide a series of insta-tips. These quick and easy lessons will help your game, from tee to green, and keep your attention. Click here for the full series of videos and check out a few clips below. Article tags Callaway Golf It's easy to think of Jack Nicholas as the most accomplished golfer in the history of the game, but there was a time when he was just a pond comer with a bright future, who struggled with the decision to turn pro. On this day in 1961, 21-year-old Nicholas announced his decision to forego his amateur status with a fantastic letter which his official Twitter account shared with his followers on Monday. In it, the man who would go on to become the Golden Bear stated that writing the letter has not been a pleasant chore but that it would have been unfair to his family to not turn pro due to the several sources of income available to me at the professional level. One of the big sticking points for Nicholas was not being able to defend his USGA amateur title in 1962. The full letter is below, it is a great read one of the toughest decisions I had to make as a young man was turning pro 56 years ago. Looking back, I can't imagine it any other way. Pick.twitter.com or 7TL1Wu7, Jack Nicholas at Jack Nicklaus November 7, 2017 article tags Jack Nicholas each week on GolfChannel.com, well examine which players' stocks and trends are rising and falling in the world of golf. Rising Patrick Cantlay 9% no cheering in the press tent, but how can you not root for Cantlay after what the former amateur stud has gone through recently, with a debilitating back injury and then the tragic loss of his best friend and caddy his win in Vegas was the first of many. J. Rose 6% His summer was disappointing, but the classy Englishman has ripped off six consecutive top tens worldwide and now back-to-back -back victories, vaulting him into contention for Europe's top prize. Kopka Brothers 4% Brooks ISNT The only Kopka with a card on a major tour. His younger brother, Chase, 23, punched his ticket to the European tour after apprenticing this year on the challenge circuit. Hmm, does that route sound familiar? AJ Mack and Ernie 3% playing on a sponsor exemption, and just a few weeks after surviving the worst mass shooting in U.S. history, the hometown product sprinted home with a closing 30 to tie for 10th in Vegas. Since he has to skip a free start at Mayakoba for the second stage of Web.com Tour Q School, maybe next week Soul Classic can step up and offer him a spot. Wink, wink. Chesson Hadley 2% with three top five finishes this fall, and 443 FedEx Cup points. The Web.com Tour graduate has already locked up his card and can freewheel at the rest of the 201,718 season. Don't be surprised if a win comes shortly. Falling so Yi and Rai's reign 1% after 19 weeks, no victories and only three top tens, she ceded the top spot in the world to rookie Sung Yun Park. J Day's U.S. Open hopes 2% it's not an injury that likely will knock Day out of the year's second major but rather the birth of his third child, due next June. A shame, because it's one of the majors he has played best, with five top tens in seven starts. JJ spawned 3% racing out to the halfway lead in Vegas, the second-year tour pro seemed well positioned for a run at his first title. He stumbled during a Saturday 73, then melted down altogether, coming home in 40 Sunday, including doubles on the last two holes when tied for the lead. Oi! Pre-tournament photo shoot 7% after Henrik Stenson suffered a season-ending rib injury during one of the WGC HSBC's high-flying promotional stunts. It seems we'll have to get our fill of players in ridiculous costumes elsewhere. 
Sung Yun Park officially moved to the top of the Rolex Women's World Rankings on Monday, becoming the 12th player to ascend to number one since the rankings were created in 2006. Park ended So Yin Rias' 19-week reign atop the rankings. It's a great honor to me and my family, Park said from Hainan Island in China at the Blue Bay LPGA. There won't be any changes because of the ranking. I believe my future play is more important than the fact that I moved up in the ranking. Shan Shan Feng moved up a spot to number three in the world with her victory Sunday at the Toto Classic in Japan. Park, 24, is the reigning U.S. Women's Open champion. She also won the Canadian Pacific Women's Open in August. She has already clinched the Louise Suggs Rolex Rookie of the Year award and leads the LPGA money list. Park is second to Lexi Thompson in a tight race for the Vare Trophy for low scoring average and second to Ryu in the Rolex Player of the Year point standings. She is third to Thompson in the race to the CME Globe standings, giving Park a chance to become the first player in LPGA history to sweep all those awards in a single season. The awards races will come down to the year's season-ending CME Group Tour Championship in Naples, FLA, next week. Article tags Sung Yun Park, So Yi and Ryu.